When it comes to making bad decisions in this game, making a Highlander is one of them. There is my hook for the intro. I hope you like it. Ever wanted to play a human character that looks like they do nothing but consume protein shakes? Ever wanted to have legs for days? Ever wanted to have a lack of expression because you got no eyebrows? Then say hello to Huron Co's Highlander, the quote-unquote better Hure. The mountain people that are taller than Midlanders and appear to be more rugged and muscular, with female Highlanders giving more tomboy energy and males giving... male energy? You are expected to grovel at the next Highlander you meet, because where I come from, we don't call them Highlanders, we call them Yes. My God. This is the Highlander experience. Highlanders are the kind of characters that will push you to make big fucking titties. They are what you can call the middleman when it comes to height, being scaled a little over your average normal person in the real world, while having the ability to be fantastical with the bare minimum customizations we are blessed to have. While male Highlanders don't get the best facial hair, it was a small price to pay for their eyebrows. They share a lot of their voices with other races, but sometimes they make it feel like they're made out of candy. That made no sense, but it segues properly. <laughs> Because they think they're made out of candy. Especially with those gummy thighs. Oh. Since Highlanders are basically humans, they have no uniqueness when it comes to character creation. No real unique hairstyles, and no unique body parts either. But they do have faces that really make you question everything. I mean, I guess you can write home the fact that you can be very muscular. So you can be a dominant person, you scrawny little bit. Highlander animations are some of the most over-the-top exaggerated expression of emotions I have ever seen. They flaunt themselves around and easily attract everyone's attention with the goofiness that is Highlander animation. It's silly, expressive and it really sells home the concept of being an extrovert. That is probably why everyone loves being these guys, and they love being around them for specific reasons. Yes, those specific reasons. Highlanders are the embodiment of extroverted energy, always finding themselves being in every single corner of this game. Male Highlanders are usually seen in places like raids and roulettes, since they just love feeling like the male superhero in a fantasy world. Female Highlanders are also seen in the same places as male Highlanders, but just not as often. You can find them in an RP club or AFKing in some capital city with the fabled hemp and chemis, showing off the booba sweat that leaks off of their tits for the degenerates to drink. I physically cringed while writing that. And here I am again reading this goddamn book that has all the tweets and YouTube comments that you guys write. Don't ask me how that works. Thighs. Mommy crush me with those thighs, please I beg of you, I am in dire need of loving and only your juicy watermelon crushers will suffice. Hempen Camis. Lars Rosenberg. Highlanders. Okay. Beefcakes. Stud. Meat. Big. Swole. Thighs. Okay. <laughs> Susanu. Fist. Thick. Normie, Crush, Giga Chad, Mommy, Beef, Fordola, Uppies, Waffle, Sando, what? I want a goth Highlander mommy to fucking step on me by crucifying me to the ground with her high heels while she makes me submit by baptizing me with her piss. Thylander, Sloppy, White Bread Toast, Overcompensating, or Just Roll Femro, High, Buff, Toned, Parent, Mother, Yummy, Big, Dom, Almost, Okay, Kunam, Voice, One, <laughs> Hildebrand, Pommenspanzer, oh my f- <laughs> Condensed Rogadin, Concupiscent, Unmids your lander, Browless, Raban, Your mom, Coom, Yanteri, or Yantere, ya Yanteri, how the fuck did they say it again? Basic, Mid, thank you for participating as always, it's nice seeing both familiar and new names being part of this segment, and with that, let's conclude it.
Highlanders are the race that the community can look at and appreciate for what they are. Not so much towards the male variation, but very much in favor towards the female side. I really wonder why. So hopefully in 8.0 they will give the males their eyebrows back, because if they don't, I might as well get myself banned while using this mod for them to add it. Should be worth it, right? <laughs>